Well, so now in order to answer this in the most honest way, I have to first, I have to first point out that high is very subjective. Okay, very good. So yeah. you, you, it's not like you're sitting around, take you know blunts, joints, bowls. Like high, I'm guessing is a couple puffs. Not high. The, what you were doing before matches, I'm guessing a couple puffs. I and, no and, and let me stop you there. So so you automatically want to base um, the quantity of of how much has been smoked to how high somebody is, but there's so many other factors. The number one yeah. being the tolerance of that person. Yes, you true, I mean? yeah, of course. But, but people don't realize that. They just wanna, they think, with, like you, I, I'm, I was smoking during this, you know right. what I mean? I don't feel any different than I did before I smoked it, you know, just yeah. a little bit of a, a little bit of a, of a stress relief, but people, in their mind are going to imagine dude he's so big you can't even look at him man he's got to wear sunglasses <laughs> and that's you know sometimes i have to cater towards that in order to advocate and to normalize and and and, and to counter to counter the um the 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 negative um agendaed opposition it's um, fine what well, re wrestlers in the 90s and 2000s when you wrestled them was anyone upset um, the fact that you indulge before matches right um probably i don't know no one ever said like dude like what are you doing like you're gonna drop me or something like I i'm not saying you were and you were going to but i imagine somebody who's not on the same side of what you're on is gonna say like this is crap what are you doing out there like what if something goes wrong and they'll blame that on you versus just a, a slip up yeah um I can think of one person that I accused of that because somebody stooged uh, on me and, uh, and I went to that person and accused them of uh, them, you know, uh, saying that, that they got hurt because they thought I was high or whatever. And they just, they denied it. Besides that, I can't remember, you know, if it has, it's possible, but I mean, nothing stands out in my mind. So I don't think, uh, um, I, I don't think there's been any memorable issues. You know, every mm -hmm. once in a while, um, you know, I'm not I, I'm not someone that can say I've never hurt anybody in my career. You know, some like Bret Hart prides himself on that. You know, there's I've busted some noses, I've knocked some people out. You know, um, and sometimes after the match, until I talk to that person, I don't know if they're going to want to fight. I don't know, especially if I don't know the person that well. So I don't want to take my boots off yet. I keep my boots on and I keep ready until, and sometimes it takes a long time, you know. Um, but during those situations, uh, I can't think uh, of, of ever going south and them uh, saying that, they, that it was uh, because I was inebriated.